Good morning kids. How are you? So today we are going to start our next chapter that is chapter number 4 in grammar book that is nouns. So um everything around us has a name. When you see in your surroundings there are so many things and they are having name such as people, animal, places and things you can see in the picture that a name of a person an animal place and thing that is called as nouns means naming words so here you can see um, so many things like, like people means the name of a person like your father mother animal you know places like countries like where you live like alipur narela these are the places and things you can see in the picture there is a bag there are books so these all are the things the flower pot you can see so these are the things which has a name that is called noun now you will be knowing that nouns are also called as naming words so anything that has a name that is called a noun now you can see in this slide that mother and father that comes under the person then cow and pig they are animals if we talk about thing that is table and book and place is the school now tell me what is it this is a chair okay it's a naming word so it is a noun the chair is a we can say it's a noun okay so ch here chair is a thing name of a thing now these are the things you can see these all are the nouns which has a name and these are the things bag clock ball and globe now what what is written over here teacher she is a teacher so it's a naming word so it comes under the person the name of a person now think about all who help you artist chef farmer soldier gardener tailor baker these all are the nouns okay naming words now see we have studied about person now animals cat and dog so these are also the naming words name of the animals so now we'll talk about the place it's a school so school here is a naming word and this is the name of a place and the name of a place is also called a noun so what we have studied that is the name of a person animal place and a thing is called as nouns that also called as naming words okay so now let's play a game so here is it this is a game and i hope you like it you will play with your family members nowadays you can play it okay as you cannot go out so you can play it so the game is and the first rule is that um there should be two persons or more than two person okay so here i'll give you that one person will give a letter that is a so the letter will be a and time start so the person other person has to write the name of a person place animal and a thing so here name of a person name of a place animal and a thing so but he should start from letter a means letter is a that so akshit a akshit then ajmer america any place you can write then animal you can write alligator or thing you can write apple so here this is a game so as quick the person will do so that will be the winner 
okay and who is not able to do that who uh, that person will be a loser so here you can give points okay this is one point who will be the winner so this game you can play at home and this is this the name of this game is naming game naming game so naming game what is a naming game that name of a person place animal or a thing but the rule is that uh, one has to write with the letter given okay so a akshit a ajmer a alligator a apple so as it is you can play more and give points so i hope you like this game name place animal thing so this is the first page of unit 4 that is nouns in your book so this is your um, grammar books page okay so here what you uh, have to do is you have to draw the pictures of the nouns in the space given like um, ball kite boat so these are the things so you can uh, you have to draw it now next you can see we have just studied that the name of a person that is yash yash is jumping here you know action word jumping that is a verb as we have already studied so here yash is a noun because it's a name of a person in second you can see the dog is barking here here who is barking here so the dog so here the dog is an animal so the name of an animal is dog so dog is a naming word that's a noun next is place we'll talk about place this is a temple so what is it this is a temple so temple is a place okay so it's a noun next is this is a book and what is the thing here that is a book so book is a thing which has a name and that is noun you can see it's written that yash dog temple and book are the naming words and naming words are also called nouns as we have already studied now this is the first question of your exercise in your book that is you have to fill the blanks with the appropriate nouns from the blackboard can you see a blackboard on the right side so you can see that some of the words that are the nouns have been written and you have to pick out the words and fill in the blanks in the correct order um like first is the dash gives us wool so who gives us wool that is sheep so that word you have to uh, pick out from the blackboard and write down there so i hope you will be able to do this exercise next is second that my dash is close today what can be the answer that is school so that you have to pick out from the board next the dash are twinkling in the sky so what twinkles in the sky that you have to write okay now i'm not going to tell you the answer you have to write now my favorite game is dash it can be anything but you have to write from the option only the dash flows under the bridge what what does flow so that you have to write then my favorite fruit is the dash so your favorite fruit can be anything but you have to pick from the board then i have a pet dash pet dog pet cat so what is written over there that you have to write so in this way you have to do this exercise and move forward we will we are having one more exercise in this what you have to do that you have to encircle the words that are not nouns so nouns you know that the naming words name of a person place animal or a thing so if it is written there in the option so that is a noun that you don't have to circle so you have to pick out the odd one odd one means which is not a noun so i'll okay i'll explain you i'll give you example first is yours x and pigeon doll and fill here x is a thing 
ant comes in animal insect and then if we talk about pigeon that's a bird so doll doll is a thing it's a toy so fill is left now fill is a verb okay action word that you know verb is an action word so what is the odd one that is fill so you have to a uh, circle you have to encircle the word fill here in okay i'll take the example now the fourth one that is um rabbit rabbit is a rabbit is an animal here so graze graze is a verb here okay let's find out some more grass is a thing and then okay egg is a uh, eatable thing then ball is a thing so what is a verb here graze so that is not a noun so we have to encircle graze because that's a verb not a noun so i hope you'll be able to do this exercise too so today's homework is just two exercise that you have to do uh, first is you have to fill the blank with the words given in the blackboard and the second one is this that you have to encircle the words that are not nouns so if it is not clear i'm going to send i have sent you the pdf even so there you can find out this exercise thank you thank